Alright, I'm here with Alexander Gustafsson, just two weeks away from maybe the biggest fight of your life. How do you feel right now? The biggest fight, I'm feeling great. I'm ready. How will you uh, prepare the last uh, remaining time until the fight? No, nothing, nothing special, just be, be positive and, and uh, surrounded by the team and, uh, and, and uh, your friends and family and having a good time. And you will go with Ilir to the uh, United States, uh, when will you go? We go on Saturday. So we have a couple of hard sessions left here in, here in the Atoll Stars and then we leave. Uh, how has the fight camp been so far? Good. Best ever. I'm, I'm super happy for the camp. Uh, no, 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 nothing that's really been, uh, been hurting or anything like that. Everything just feels, feels great. All right, so we, you talk about uh, at the, this very hard training in this tough sport earlier. How do you balance the hard training with trying to stay injury-free for a fight uh, of this caliber? Well, you have to be smart and you have to listen to, to your coaches, and that's what I've been doing. I've been trying to be smart with the training and, and uh, been listening to my, to my coaches. And But with that said, you have to push yourself every day, and, and uh, we managed to do, to do that. So. Right. Uh, in the last uh, press conference with John Jones, you got into kind of a scuffle and he pushed you. Can you just talk a little bit about what happened? No, he, I, I don't know where he came from. He just pushed me. He, he took a step in front of me, so I took a step in front of him and then he just pushed me. I think he's, 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 not, really, he's not really there. He's, he's, he's very, he's, he, I think it's, he, doubt, he doubts himself and, and he's very uh, insecure. That's, that's my feeling. That's what I felt when he, when he did that. He's not really like him doing that stuff so but it's, it's, it's even better all right uh, earlier dana white told uh, said that if um, you and uh, Ilir latifi uh, would fight if the if the fans wanted that fight that fight will happen uh, what do you have to say about that no no we're not going to fight it's a friend of mine okay. uh, and uh, and going back to the last press conference with jones you told him also that you didn't lose your last fight uh, do you feel that way and my fight with Jones the first time. Uh, well, it is what it is. We, I had this question a million times, and I don't know. Whatever. It's I lost that fight. I lost that fight, and and um, that's the way it is. And and uh, but you know, it, it was a it, wa it was a, a big step in my in my career. Even if I lost that fight, it was still a big step in my career. It was the greatest fight of all time in the light heavyweight division, and I'm I'm happy to be a part of it. And we have got a new fight in front of us, and I'm here to make a statement. I'm here to, to beat the man that's never been beaten. I'm going to take that gold and bring it to Sweden. Uh, so last time you said you would knock him out in the fourth round. Is that still your prediction? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm looking for a knockout. I'm looking for a knockout. All right. Thank you very much. Thank you.